whenever you're in a jam where your seat is not reclining or it's not even well you can slide forward right um first thing i will do is check the fuse right you got a fuse for this seat and also have a fuse for the um the driver's seat right but if the fuse is good right um next thing i'll do is make sure that you know it's sliding back and forth once it's sliding back and forth or it's reclining that's letting me know that this you know i'm getting power to the seat right they have a let's say it's not a module but it's like a um let's call it a probably like a switch or it's a switch but it's like a board right here right and sometimes the board starts to glitch so i'm going to show you a way to bypass that right anytime you're getting a jam where your seat is not reclining or it's not coming forward like this one you see i'm putting it forward and back i'm getting nothing but if i go forward or back you see that it's moving right so this also let me know that i'm getting power to this module so on this um seat they have a motor right where two like variable motors on each side right to control the rec uh, reclining of the, the backrest and also to the horizontal right i got the seat basically propped up right i removed the four 14 millimeter half inch bolts right um basically the switch is under this panel so right so we can pull up a wiring diagram if you want but i mean we could keep it simple right just while you flip the seat up look on on the motor right in this case is a yellow and red um cable coming off from it or wire right so you just look on the harness and that's the basically the pins that we're going to be using right you gotta get a jumper cable i mean jumper wire right and a 9 volt battery right and i'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do just flip the seat over it just take out the four bolts that's holding it um basically i went to the pin that goes to the motor right and what i'm gonna do here i just got my little jumper cable here yes it's a 12 volts that go to it but i'm using a 9 volt battery right as i said the problem was that the switch was not working on the recline right so i'm just gonna as i said a 12 volt battery right i mean a 9 volt battery sorry right and i'm just gonna go forward with it right you see the seat moving right and what i'm i wanted to go back so i'm just gonna go reverse right as i said you don't gotta use a power probe or anything like that you just gotta use a 9 volt battery right and basically it's the disconnect so i'm not gonna hurt anything right i'm just gonna go back you got basically a faulty switch right you gotta replace this whole it's like a board right um sometimes when you hit the whack give it a whack it works but the switch basically is out right the horizontal is working but not the recline and yeah that's it so i hope this helps someone don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button leave a comment thanks for watching